I remember the first time I ever seriously asked the question. My home church was celebrating its homecoming Sunday. And I was in my mid-twenties, had, had participated in the worship service that morning. But that afternoon, at the church picnic, our popular preacher drowned in the old swimming hole. It was horrible. The whole church was there. The preacher's wife and his two children, even his dad, watched in horror when his body was dragged ashore. Everybody prayed for his recovery, but all attempts at resuscitation were unsuccessful. People were sobbing and screaming. But there was one family member who wasn't there. Greg, his 14-year-old son, had stayed home that day with the flu. A half hour later, a friend of the family and I drove up to the house to tell Greg what had happened. Now, how do you tell a 14-year-old boy that his dad, his hero, is gone? It was one of the most difficult things I ever had to do. I felt really terrible for him. That's when I kept asking the question, where was God? Why would God let this happen? Why would God let Gerald Comp drown? I didn't have the answer. I didn't understand it.